Hello everybody, Sift here again with another Backpack Hero run. And today I'm going to be doing the Lizard King Sword run. Now, uh, this uh, item existed, but they changed it, they remade it, and they also added a new item, the Lizard Blade. Now, the Lizard Blade is a 2 energy deal 16 damage weapon. I'm not going to use this, I just want to showcase that it exists. And on average, I think it's not really that good, so I'm not going to use it at all. I'm just uh, showcasing that it exists, and there's that. Now, what the Lizard King Sword does though, which is, you know, the change and the reason why I'm doing this run is that for two energy it does 20 damage and adjacent weapons get to minus one to their energy cost minimum of one and this lasts for the whole combat so the idea is turn one i use the lizard king sword and if opponents don't attack us for two energy and then if opponents don't attack us i for one energy use the other lizard king sword otherwise uh, i mean that's what i'm gonna do because i don't have a shield right now and uh, then i will use the other lizard king sword uh, which will cost one energy it will also reduce this lizard king sword cost but that that's irrelevant i will just spawn one of the two blades and um yeah i mean that's pretty much the whole idea behind this build now if this is a good build if it's a good idea i don't know but i mean i wanted to do it now obviously to maintain the balance of this whole idea we are going to uh throw away the first two legendaries we find i could have also went with uh you know i only pick up the items after the fact but whatever uh so here you see this now costs one energy and this also costs one energy but it's irrelevant i'm only gonna be using one of the two now we got for one energy 20 damage after the first turn is there a reason why I'm opening up these? I think I should go something like that. Uh, actually, I should maybe go something like this. Or, uh, yeah, let's, let's do something like this. I don't know. No idea. No big plans. Let's go with cool drink. Let's go with, uh, you know, poison the opponents. And I guess another 10 damage or something. I'll also get the money. And uh, let's go to the next fight. Little B, Muscat Brigade. Muscat Brigade and Rodwolf. Let's go with Little B and Muscat Brigade. As there will be, I mean, um, it tends to not do that much okay this guy is dead and dead very nice very clean and quick kills assassinations as i would say let's get energy uh what is this An electric wand i mean might as well t take it right now it's a one mana seven damage for pretty much free and the rest really relevant might as well take the rose i don't know i don't know, no, I don't know the lyrics man i'm really bad at lyrics i'm only good at music i'm not good at lyrics so boom and then boom and bye and wizard and I don't want to lose more life. Boom, bye bye. Easy enough. Okay, find even more energy. The more energy we find, the better. Uh, let's also take the brick just in case we do a brick build. I really like the sound that they added to that. I'm not sure if it always existed. Uh, and uh, let's also get this. Or I can just go for a good old tunic instead of going for this whole weird stuff. Like throw this away, keep this. Throw this away, throw this away, get the tunic and done. <clears throat> I mean, throw these away for sure. Yeah, I think this seems a bit better on average. Yeah, this is like 5 defense for free pretty much. I can still keep one thing though, so let's keep, I guess, the rose. Oh, I hit my I hit my little pinky on my... Oh, I'm dying. I'm in pain. <laughs> uh, you're a toast and you're a toast too. Very nice. Very powerful run right now. Let's just go in circles around. You know what? I will start a line towards the left here, okay? So that if I find the thing that gives us one energy as long as things are not around it, I can for once use it. What is this? Dual Link Sword. One energy can be used one time each combat, deals 25 damage. You know what? That smells like money to me. So uh, let's throw away this. And uh, let's... You know what? Let's throw that away actually so that we have more room in this way. Oh, I have to throw one of the things we found here out. Ah, let's throw the armor. I mean, we're not gonna get attacked now, are we? Are we? Let's throw this out too. I do prefer one energy over one spike. Who cares about spikes? Boom, sell it. Very nice. <laughs> He's selling like a fish. This guy's a fish merchant. That guy's a fish merchant. And nothing of importance. Although, we got a fish oid. And then I could have gone with the fish mer merchant's fish. Maybe um, I am a lizard to the infinite, which means I'm also eating fish. I'm a true lizard, not one of those phony lizards. Uh, I can get a dragonfly to damn DPS increase. Let's also do this. Mm, I don't think there isn't anything else of importance here. This is not common. Might as well go and sell it. Three axes. Okay, let's sell this. And there is no legendary here. Doesn't matter. Once again, first two legendaries are gonna get lost. Okay, this is a rare. Eh, let's pick up the rare for money. Very left should always be left. Okay, got it. Done. Pick this up. Run over to the shop to sell it before we go anywhere else. 
and run over here, find the next event, useless, we don't even talk to that guy, next event, useless, but uh, the shield might be something insane, legendary, boom, easy, rare, <laughs> Uh, it is what it is, but but I will make sure that it's going to buff this thing. So let's go with here and uh, like this. And then here we can do something like, could I not do this better? Yeah, I can do this better. We can do this easy enough. Now it's going to move left and then whoop around and left, right, like right, right and left, right and left. I don't know what's happening lately. I'm mixing up left and right. I like the words. It's not like I'm mixing up what it means like if somebody tells me left and then i know that left is this side and the right is this side i know that for guarantee but you know i have this thing where i'm mixing up words so i'm saying like left while actually meaning right um so yeah let's uh let's go on it's it's not the same issue that some other people have with um actually not knowing where left and right is because in case you're new to the earth <laughs> people do not Remember left and right, not all of them do. We found a red hoodie, so that's a Wonderbots item, and we're gonna take it. <laughs> and when I say Wonderbots, I meant Retromations, I'm sorry. Uh, I'm sorry I'm not, if I offended anybody. I'm not sure I did. Anyway, let's go on. Why did I say I'm not sure? I, I should. Let's go on, let's just go on and stop talking about meta stuff. Now what this thing does is we heal three, we get three max HP every time we get hit. So it's uh, pretty good, it's pretty good. 3 max HP every time we get hit. And uh, not hit, we lose life every time we lose life. And uh, did I say pretty good? No, it's, it just exists. <laughs> I almost never used it. So let's uh, open up the left line with uh, for the reason I was mentioning. And maybe even go below here in case we find boots. Ah, I tried. I tried to affect my luck, but I wasn't lucky enough. Now, one, two, three, four, five spots are open. So that means, theoretically, I should be able to fit the tunic somewhere or the other. Like uh, here, for example. Easy, easy. Now all of these are interacting with each other. And now this would be better if it was here hitting everything. But I, I can't do anything about that. At least the way I'm seeing it right now. And uh, this can go down here and we can even get a little spiky helmet. Especially if it gives us four spikes in a block. Against two block and this is three block. This I don't care about spikes. Let's go here. Two block and plus one block to something adjacent. I can I, I will level up and start uh, reorganizing. And this is pretty useless. Let's go with we take less damage I guess. Uh, let's continue. Muscat Brigat. Was there any key there? I don't think I saw any key. That's max Mac, and uh, that's 21 defense, okay. 21 defense is a lot, so... Oh no, I lost XP here, my bad. Should have assassinated the Muscat Brigat. But I didn't. This is an uncommon Golden Cleaver, we go pound energy, but... I mean, we don't really have room for energy, unless I throw the Iron Helmet out. I don't think I need energy. Let's get the region and just be gone. Wench. Wait a minute, did I just curse? I'm not sure. Is... Is that really the curse? Uh, is that like a, an explicit word or whatever? I'm, I'm not exactly sure. I guess it's gonna be one of those things where... Comment down below about it, so I will learn the English language a bit better. Let's continue. Pop, pop, pop. Oh no, he's doing 10 damage to us. I'm kidding, it's a joke. And 20, 20, bye bye, easy. And we found energy. I'm definitely gonna throw this away for energy. <laughs> any day of the week, any second of my life, any... We found a, a, a healing. We found healing. Well, well, well. It's a legendary. I'm forced to not pick it up because of the rules. And we're gonna go on with our lives. It is what it is. I'm trying to maintain a sense of balance. Although that's like literally self-imposed challenge, I guess, for sandbagging or whatever. Uh, I don't have as much defense I was gaining previously. Defense, max, mac. I'm gonna lose one life here. But we gain three max life out of that... Yeah, we got him. That's what you happens when you do 80 damage per turn. I don't need those. Let's see the max health drop happen. Let's continue going on. Unknown event. Oi, 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 oi. <laughs> this guy voice changes lately. Pretty often. Uh, I'm willing to take the 16 as long as I do 60. When I do 60 damage turn 1 and then 80 damage turn 2. As long as I have two of these, right? Uh, I mean, this, no, 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 this is literally the same with the tunic. Well, wouldn't it be nice if I could have four tunic? Throw, throw the hoodie away. I mean, yeah, okay, the hoodie is awesome and all that, but 
it gives zero block and it also adds zero block while this now gives seven block all these all three of these give seven blocks so that's 21 block turn one which 21 block is a pretty a pretty important cutoff point like 21 damage is almost as much damage as you take from a lizard fight in act three so i am the lizard king and i want to be able to counter the lizards okay all of these are useless as i don't have any more inventory space let's avoid that almost made a mistake there Okay, this, this, this. Oh, now I'm gaining 25 armor. Wait, what changed? It's changed. Okay, we got a level. So I want this, so I put this here. You know, this goes here and this so that I uh, continue my expansion. Easy enough. I could also do this, by the way. I get, these are still, uh, these, uh, these are still connected. Ooh, five block against, ooh, these are better actually. These give two block, but also two to each adjacent. So if I have three things adjacent, all of them are going to give two block to themselves. And then another four block out, that's six block. Uh, uh, no, and, the, and these do two to themselves. Yeah, okay, cancel, cancel what I was saying. Yeah, these are better. Because they are five plus one, seven. Why do they... Yeah, and then one for the shield, exactly. So the, these are niners, while these are going to be less than niners. I mean, look at this. This now has ten block. Yeah, but th themselves have seven and seven. And if I put another one here, instead of having seven, they're going to have eight, which is less than nine. By the way, it would be nice if I could have had another tunic now, wouldn't it? <laughs> but I cannot, alas. Let's go with this and let's continue. Oh, isn't this a rare? Yep, isn't there a shop? Nope. Well, uh, if there isn't a shop, then the rare doesn't really matter. I guess I can get the key, though. Let's uh, go on. See what we find. Ye region, why not? I found another one of those bronze blast plates. So I could have had three bronze plus bait. Let's throw the key away. Let's see what we find. Okay, we found another tunic. Uh, yeah, now we're going to continue. Would be nice if I could have four tunics. The tunic brothers. I mean, this is supposed to be the lizard king run, but if we're going to become the tunic masters, it would be nice too. I prefer them like this. Actually, I prefer them like this. As if I'm like a... Ooh, the crab symbol. Nice. Astrology. Sif knows astrology. Woo. <laughs> I mean, I don't know astrology. I just know uh, my own uh, astrology sign. And now you got another information about Sif. Uh, stop. <laughs> Sif related info for people that actually care about it. Uh, let's go energy. I found another tunic, man. Imagine having like 50,000 tunics. By the way, I can use this mod. If you want to see completely broken and weird stuff, you can use this mod to make your inventory be like 50 times 50 or something crazy. Like you can get huge inventory sizes with um, this. What? Wait a minute. Whoa, here we go. So this is uh, used once. Yeah, you throw this away. I got one dodge there. <laughs> And, um, well, for now, we're going to take this and have it be useless. Actually, no, we're going to have it here. So now this also gives us... I have two masks that give us dodge. And uh, obviously, I'm going to change things around here in a moment. I want the one mask to be here, uh, where it is, actually. <laughs> I need the next level to be like these two spots, if it's possible. Or, or, or like one spot here, but that's useless because there is a spot above it. Yeah, I don't see a solution on where this mask could go. I mean, uh, in addition to the tower shield ne being needed. On use adds one dodge. If this is not the top row, uh, it's disabled. Yep. So let's continue. Does it mean the very top row or the top row of itself? Oh, the top row of itself. Okay, fair enough. Poison is incoming. A bunch of things are incoming. Well, I can't do anything about it. At least the front line is not going to poison us. The back line is, but the back line is also uh, irrelevant. Lens dead, and we're gonna dodge the 27 as we do not have enough defense. Yeah, continuous macaroning for 80 damage per turn. <laughs> Insane. Legendary. Is there a shop anywhere? Nope. Forget the legendary. Let's go for healing. <laughs> and uh, let's go on with our lives. Is there a key here? Nope. Let's go on. I like that. By the way, I'm saying, is there a key here? And nope, and stuff like that. I, I really enjoy the fact that people were spamming in the comments in the in one of the previous videos about the fact that I missed like a thousand uh, mana potions while I was doing a mana run. Although that run wasn't even a mana run. Like the run itself was um, a rage gain. I don't know what. What is this? Are you kidding me? Why, why do these bugs happen so often? Like why can I not read this? I don't understand. I don't understand why the floating floating over items bug exists. Uh, another key. 
Yep, let's go for another key. Let's go on. I'm, I'm not sure if I, st I have paid off both legendaries that I should have paid off. Oh, I did, I did, I did, I did. I just got the robot thing, right? Just because I put in the inventory and didn't mention that, oh, we have to still pay off. It doesn't mean that I didn't pay off. Yep, that was the second legendary, all right. That was the second Lizard King's Road paid off. I obviously would have enjoyed getting the healing gem. Uh, I would have put it easily somewhere. Like I could even do this. Imagine this being the healing gem. But alas, it is gone because of my own rules. I mean, I can bend them however I want, but I try to avoid bending them that much. It's gone. So I'm just doing 80 damage per turn. As simple as that. Would be nice if I gained here the... First of all, they're doing 25 damage on the dot. Would be nice if I could gain... What would be nice if I could gain it? First of all, because I'm not doing enough DPS, I need to clear out both ads. Definitely. Clear out this ad. Start clearing out this ad. And then we kill this ad this turn. No, this guy gave him too much defense. Yep, this ad is dead. Now next turn I'm gonna start attacking the next ad. I got this, I got this. There is a plan, there is a plan. I took a bit too much damage here. So now I will kill this ad with three attacks and I will throw a couple to the boss. Two attacks actually into the boss, nice. I spawns an ad. You know what? Forget it. DPS the boss. That was a huge mistake. I didn't play this correctly. I could have killed the boss like in three turns after the fact. But like from the moment I decided to play this a different way, from that moment onward, I could have killed the boss. <laughs> One turn later. And in four turns or something. Bye bye both of you. Wee wee. Give me at least um the 25% damage boost. Okay, or or not. This is items get anchored. Well, all of these are useless. Do you know what's good though? I could get a shield spirit and put it like where exactly where the tunic is and just start using the shield that I gain. Or or I can avoid spikes. <laughs> Let's go with I avoid spikes and not go with the shield thing again for the thousandth time. Now this build is very quickly gonna die in endless mode. <laughs> like the moment we enter endless mode, we're gonna get toasted, if not already. But uh, it is what it is, you know. People have been telling me to not try to always not to not try to always super duper min max every single fight and thing. And you know that's a nice assessment. I can play a bit more chilly sometimes too. Uh, let's start going for the snake. Missed. Yep, exactly. As I said, this guy does not do more than 20 damage. Boom, boom, dead. Let's go. I mean, he he can do up to 21 or something. 10 rage. I take the eight. I take the eight. Chris is always being bad. Oh, I should have dodged. Yeah, that's gonna get... Oh, nope. It's nothing. I did not dodge on purpose. Everything went fine. I could go for healing, or I could keep the cleansing flame alongside both rogues masks. I just need one more level. 2 XP is missing. You know what this 2 XP that's missing is? It's the... It's that one Muscat Brigade that I left go. That is what that XP... That missing XP is. Here, here, here. Very nice. Let's go on. Oop. Nothing. Chris incoming. Obviously 11 poison is more than whatever the Chris is gonna do to us. Which is gonna be like 13 damage. 9 damage. Okay, fair enough. Boom, 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 boom. And let's dodge because why not? I mean, the why not would be because I wouldn't get damaged anyway, but... The, the other why not is... That, <laughs> uh, first of all, I can go more to the right, so I'm gonna go both right. Perfect. Secondly, I can get one more level. There isn't more to the left of this, so that's nice to see. I guess I can go one here. In case I want to put something in this corner so that I will be able to push this to the right. I had one job to not take that literally one spot. Does this have uh, helmets on the right are disabled? Helmets on the right are disabled. Unbelievable, man. How hard was it to not take that only spot? Like, that was the only spot that I should not have taken. Literally, from all of these spots, from everything, this is the one spot that I should not have taken. Okay, you know what? Forget the rogue's mask. It, it, it won't function, function anywhere. I can put it here. Yeah, I mean, it does work here. But I wanted it here so that it also adds two block to us. Whatever. I'm, I'm really disappointed to myself. Like, was it so hard? Was it really so hard? Let's go defense. Got the energy. Was it so hard to remember one thing? Man, I'm... I'm <laughs> I'm like a person that's very, very, very... Uh, I see something and I click on it. And then literally a second later, I'm instantly regretting the decision. And uh, you saw how fast that happened. Like, you saw how fast I realized that I made a mistake. Like, the moment I pressed ready, that was the millisecond that instantly I realized that, whoops, I made a mistake. But before I press the ready button, no. Before I press the ready button, I'm like, oh, let's open this and this and this. Or no, ha -ha, let's not even think about it. And then the moment I press the ready button, then it's the second that, oh! 
this was not a good idea, and this was also not a good idea, and that was also not a good idea. Like, it happens so often, man. It happens so often. Anyway, let's continue. It's not like we have room. Let's go over here. Throw that in the bin. Let's go over here. <laughs> oh, we got a wizard cab. Oh, yeah, let's go. And why did I open this pot up? Because, by the way, I opened this pot up because I wanted to do this. And I was calculating that I will get the healing. Do you remember that the legendary healing thing that we happened to roll? Yeah, that thing retroactively affected my decision here. Which is obviously a bad one. Uh, let's have the curse further away from where it is right now. I want the curse somewhere in this corner. Because I want to try to get this item. Come on, send the curse to the very left, please. Not the right. The very left. Oh, come on. Okay, last attempt. If it doesn't... Got it. Now we're gonna throw this here and some here and hope it somehow goes to this. Ah. All for not. All for not. Is this a rare one? When a wand kills things. Whatever. Snake ohm fight. Pretty easy fight. I'm gonna continue. First turn four attacks. Wait, do I have five energy? Wait, what? Do, do, do. Oh, I, yeah, okay, I didn't attack. <laughs> I had one more mana. I was like, wait a minute, that's the same amount of attacks I did the first turn. What happened? Yeah, the me not pressing the button happened. <laughs> I'm swinging each uh, sword once in a while. I hope, 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 two times the same helmet, which I still cannot read and don't know what it is and what it does. Oh, you can right click it though. Okay, fair enough then, fair enough. I mean, not actually because it's a bug, but still, let's say, let's just, let's just say fair enough. Uh, nothing of importance, honestly speaking. Okay, this fight is obviously going to cost us a bit of life because that guy poisons. How did it happen that I didn't roll a single healing item from the start of me losing life until this point? I still haven't rolled a single healing item. I don't know how that happens. Take that away. Let's go take damage. Should have maybe dodged. Ah, no, not really. Bye-bye. Okay, I found a healing item, but it's a two-spot. You, you can't have it all, man. You can't have it all. Keep the game. It's gone. I hate you. Stop existing. Wait, you know what? Different item, same rarity. Here. It's a rare. Give me another rare. It's the whatever potion. Why that's a rare and why it exists, who knows? Give me healing. You gave me a shield. You are fired. You're never gonna get gained again. Never gonna get gained again. Continue attacking. Take another curse. Lose another 11 life. Continue not finding healing. Dodge for no reason. <laughs> I'm never gonna find the heal, man. We're gonna die from the bot. Oh, we found healing. Let's go. Eight health. Love it. Or I could go with speed and uh, for the next fight. Nah, speed is a one-time item. Two out of three. Let's go. As you see, this build is not something crazy. Not even remotely close to being crazy. Let's go the double ohm fight instead of Queen Bee and Blade Master. I know these guys are scaling, but I can easily just be like dodge. Smack, 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 and then next turn dodge again, smack, 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 and then after that one of the two is dead and that's that. Dodge, smack, 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 okay. And now the right side is obviously dead next turn, so dodge is not gonna be needed. And 33 defense is enough uh, to buy me, it is gonna buy me enough time until I kill here the first ohm. And I also am removing his rage, so it's not even like he does anything. He just exists. Whoop, whoop. Is with King's Roar, let's go. Okay, uh, let's get the defense. Might help us, might not even matter. I'm gonna skip a couple of fights here. Because I want to at least get to the boss, you know. Uh, let's go here, smack, smack, smack. I have no scaling whatsoever. I have no percentage-based damage whatsoever. In general, the build is very whatsoever-y. <laughs> Meaning bad. Okay, we need to start DPSing down and forget spawns. Actually, that's really bad what's happening right now. That's guy dead. That's guy dead. That's guy dead. Sif talk, man. Sif talk. Okay, we just go for the boss, all in. Uh, right now, we take... We take... Let's block... No, no, this is... This is not that much damage. This is like 37, and we have 33 shield. I'm, I'm willing to take that much damage. I'm gonna use this when it's above 10. Okay, like, we didn't take above 10, that's certain. You were taking 3D to, yeah, we would definitely block this. Very nice. 
And now, though, now we're taking a lot of damage. I think it's a blocking time. That should not block everything. Actually, she should block everything. Because if these were 20s, I would be taking 60. And I had 58 defense. And these were in 20s. Wait, what? Oh, it would be 80. No, I was off base. So much off base. <laughs> that was 80 damage incoming. Can I even survive? This is 19 damage. I'm thinking about using both dodges next turn instead of using one now and one next. Because next turn is going to be even more damage. And I want to get value out of my shielding. Uh, this is, let's say, 20. And let's say this is 15. So that means that this is 40, 35, 40, 55 damage. And uh, my life is 57. Okay, I need to dodge right this moment. And then next fight, I'm most likely going to die. <laughs> next attack is death sentence time. Okay, and dodge, and if we survive, we survive. I mean, there isn't anything I can actually do. This is 60 damage, we're dead. Wow, we're just dead. Okay, uh, I mean, yep, we died. You told me not to min-max all the time. This is what happens if you don't min-max all the time, man. <laughs> the lizard sword run. Should I do another one with this? Can I min-max this a lot further? Can I min-max this a lot further? Mm, I mean, I, I can. Theoretically, I can. You know what? Let me let me create the most broken lizard build right this moment. So, give, give me a sec. You know what we're going to do? We're going to do the following. I'm going to generate more lizard swords. Uh, give me a second. Okay, I'm back. I changed opinion. I changed opinion. So, let me, talk, let me tell you what we're going to do. Do you remember when you got the gemstone heart? I just generated it, and I'm going to try to now win with the gemstone heart. Like, I want to see if that item is a difference. Like, I want to see if the challenge was the reason why we died. Like, me imposing a self-challenge on myself that I'm not going to pick up legendaries. Or if it was just that this this was doomed to fail from the start. Because, honestly speaking, I don't want to do another run. And I also don't want to do something like, oh, I'm going to use uh, golden whetstones and whatnot to do whatever, you know. I'm pretty sure a bunch of people, the moment they see me die, they left. I know I'm watching the analytics and the retention rate and a bunch of people leave whenever I die. That is why I'm not on that way. That's why I'm always min-maxing, by the way. Like, I have been told that, yo, Sift, you don't need to literally have every single run be a busted run, a win run. You don't need to all the time try to be the most perfect, you know, player ever. Which I'm not even, by the way, but I'm just saying I, I, I don't need to try to do that, is what I'm meaning to say. But then... But then you got things like these, right? And then you got uh, very boring runs. And also, then you all get people literally not staying to see the video when I lose. So, like, you say the one thing, and people like the comment that said that one thing. But the people don't actually do that. Like, yeah, your opinion is valid. Yeah, I should not try to always win. I should not always try to min-max. I should not always try to, um, you know, do the best possible run possible. But then people don't care, don't want to see it, so... Yes, but no, as the pirate says. Anyway, as you see, the difference here with the gemstone heart that I decided to throw away on purpose is uh, is huge. We should have blocked there. There was no reason for us to take all that damage. And there isn't another reason to take all that damage right now either. So we're gonna continue this run, obviously. Uh, now, the next death is... it's it's over. Like, I, I'm gonna just say that, okay, I have, like, one continue because I died. But uh, next run, no matter like no matter what happens, if I die again, the run the run ends on the spot. Let's go, I guess, down here. I mean, I have no idea. The moment I press done, instantly regret. <laughs> instantly regret. The moment I would press done. Anyway, let's go with opponents. That's useless. This is useless. That's completely useless. Olm Olm. Olm Olm is easy. Might as well go for it. Let's also throw this useless thing away. As we do have the candle, therefore we will, uh, you know, make opponents do less. I could have first attacked and then used that, but uh, who cares, man? Like, literally, who cares? It's the same thing. I'm not gonna lose life in this area anyway. Yep, and all the back lines, never gonna do 33 damage. So we're gonna continue healing. Oh, I like your ring. Maybe I want that. No, I don't. Let's continue. Let's go onwards. Now, about the endless, obviously, there is no reason to go into an endless. Like, this, this build is so mediocre. By the way, I really enjoy what we are doing here. Like, I really enjoy... First of all, as I said... Oi, 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 First of all, as I said, the Endless has almost no meaning. Uh, obviously, because of the fact that this is not a really powerful build. This is actually not even a build that should exist. 
Uh, but I like the idea of testing new stuff, right? I do enjoy the fact of, oh, we're gonna use this Lizard King Sword, which, by the way, happens to combo with itself. So might as well try to see what the Lizard King Sword run looks like, you know? If it's powerful, if it has some unique mechanics and whatnot. You know, in reality, I didn't gain anything crazy. I guess it would be good with that relic that says you gain 25% more damage for connected weapons. Ooh, we got a Flame Axe. I guess the Flame Axe is the payoff of the Gemstone Heart. I guess. Uh, doesn't really matter. Is there a key? No. Do, is this event? This event is oi oi oi. And uh, yeah, let's go. There is no reason to fight that as I'm not going to be gaining a level. Might as well go to the final boss and uh, go and lay to rest. Maybe the final boss is going to kill us too. It's the Grandmaster. Okay, the Grandmaster is most likely going to kill us because we only do 80 damage per turn. Yeah, we're most likely dead here because we do 80 damage per turn. And uh, I mean, other than, yeah, literally the first turn included. And he has 900 life. And he's spawning units that I cannot kill in one turn. Uh, are we dead? First of all, do I need to DPS down the Grandmaster? Yeah, I need to DPS down the Grandmaster. Because he's doing flame and then spawning. And then flame and then spawning. So we definitely, definitely need to do that. This is not enough damage for me to care. So let's take this damage. And we're gonna go down swinging, man. We're gonna go down swinging. 23 damage, that's nothing. And the Chris is most likely also gonna be nothing. So we're gonna take that. If the Chris is region perfect, it is region perfect. <laughs> Unbelievable. Okay, let's give him the regen. Let's give him this Micaronis. And I think this is still not enough damage, especially because I'm gonna block the 12. Oh, no, 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 no. Blah, too much damage. Okay, we're dead. Uh, if I do a double block, yeah, we're gonna do double block here. The one block is gonna be blocking the 12er. Should I shield? Because a bunch of flame is incoming, that's my idea here. So I think I should double block. One hit is gonna block the 12 attack. The other is gonna hit the the flame. No, the flame is already blocked. I mean, I'm gonna take a bit of flame damage. Ah, oh, this is so over. This is like so over. And I will repeat, there is no reason for me whatsoever to try to assassinate these two. Okay, we took a lot of damage. And we're dead. This, the, the incoming attack is gonna kill us. 14 damage, what should we block? This doesn't matter, continue giving the region whatever, boom. Yep, 44 flames incoming, and dead. Oh, I'm on two life. I'm still alive. I'm gonna go down swinging. Uh, you know what, I could block. I'm kidding, block would not save us. This is eight and five block per use, so that's up to 20 block. Do you think 20 block would save us with 43 damage incoming and another 27 on top of that? I hope you guys didn't, because I was sure it wouldn't. So this wasn't a good build. What can you do? I guess that goes into the, I'm not always doing an oh, insane build. I should have died with the curse instead of trying to do it. Anyway, this time we actually officially died. I mean, there is no way we beat this fight no matter what we do even. I mean, not, not no matter what we do. I can obviously force even more things like more relics and more items and more weapons and more A, B, C, D. But I don't want to do it. Now, I'm not sure if the idea of being with three tunics and like a shield that buffs them is good. I, I'm not exactly sure if it was a good build itself, but like the rest of the build, the supporting build alongside the Lizard King Swords, I'm not sure if that was good enough, but I think it was, like, we had a pretty decent build. It was that we were not doing enough damage, like, if you actually sit down and think about it, it was the fact that we were not doing enough damage. 80 damage per turn in this game is not really enough. Like, people might think that, yo, Sift, you're breaking the game always and the game is very easily breakable. Yes, but that is part of the balance. Because if you don't break the game, then you most likely will uh, face a very hard challenge. And in endless mode, you will most likely die in the first boss that's going to have 3,000 life. So, definitely you will die in the shadow fight. So, yeah, like... It's, it's fair, it's fair, it's fair. I wanted to see the legendary, it's a pretty useless one. Could have been a better one. Maybe it's good with the spirit shield plus a shield because this does like 20 damage baseline. So if you have, for example, 10, king, 10 of these lizard king swords around the shield, you could be busted. Actually, let me show you how that would look like, you know? Let me show you how that would look like. Give me a second, I'm coming right back up. Okay, I'm back. This, this is what it would look like. Unbelievable, right? Everybody knew that it's gonna be a shield spirit run. Like, this is literally what it would look like. Uh, so, I think this is the most min-maxi way we could use this. I'm just gonna showcase here this on the boss, but uh, other than that, I mean, it doesn't matter. We just spawn this. I mean, look how much damage we're doing. And now we're actually talking. Now we're doing eight times... Um, yeah, like, eight times whatever. Eight, eight, eight times two, so that's like 160 damage per pop. Yeah, pretty powerful stuff. But still... 
very boring <laughs> in my opinion and um yeah i mean that's that's it pretty much that's it pretty much not boring not boring it's obviously busted and it's fun when you play this i mean i'm i'm saying some things that are negative that aren't actually true because i just have played the game enough to find the shield spirit plus um, the soldier's buckler plus eight weapons pretty boring but it's not actually boring when you do the run when you play the game then it's awesome you know when you actually do this by the way the the, the game is now in, as a free demo not not with the toad and stuff i i don't know what exactly the demo includes but now the game is as a free demo on steam so uh you, you can just go there and uh, you know it exists in steam so yeah as i said uh, we're gonna end the video here now the stats are obviously skewed because of what i just did i'm sorry if you wanted to see my previous stats uh but as far as i know this is no longer possible right as far as i know i can no longer go into my previous run as now the game is saved with my infinite oh no some for some reason it doesn't save the game in front of the boss it saves it back here uh, so I guess these are my stats before I kill the boss, but well, before I start the cheat, if you care about it. But otherwise, I cheat, whatever. I cheat, I cheat. Why am I saying cheat? Like, cheat sounds so negative. Be before I modded the game, that's what we're gonna use. Because before I started to um, test around stuff and experiment. I hope you guys, first of all, enjoyed the run. If you did, drop a like. Helps out the channel as always. And I hope you guys also enjoyed the exploration part. Oh, and something for the people that stay here very last. Uh, have I ever mentioned that we got a setup for third character, CR8? So, in case you didn't know, this character is most likely gonna, gonna come out one of these next days, weeks. I don't know, maybe it's gonna come out in three days, maybe it's gonna come out in five, maybe in ten, maybe in fifteen. But I don't think it's gonna come out in fifteen days. I think this character is gonna come out earlier. And um, I'm really excited for this game to start having enough characters so that just for the, from, the sheer, from the sheer fact that there are like 10 characters i can just all the time um spice it up a bit you know i want to i i want to really see this game uh go out of hand and be too fast for me to cover everything because at this point i've covered most of the things like three two or three more runs and i have covered everything in the new patch and honestly i was like if, if this game patches two or three more new items every week and like one or two boss relics every week then we're gonna be really good and man, oh man, these guys added like 10, 10, 10, 15 items in one expansion, although it took them two or three weeks, so I guess it's almost the same. I think it took them only two weeks. Like, when did Tote launch? I think Tote launched, Tote, Tote, Tote launched like 13 days ago, 15 days ago or something like that. So, um, yeah, I mean, this this game is this game is not stopping the gas. Full on pedal to the metal, and I really enjoyed it. So, yeah, that's it. As I said, I hope you guys enjoyed what you were seeing. Uh, and if you want to see more, maybe subscribe. But that's on you. I mean, you can do what you want. And as always, thanks for the Patreon and membership supporters. And uh, yeah, that's it pretty much. Once again, I hope you guys enjoyed that run. That was not an extremely crazy, busted, everything gets destroyed. Uh, we go into an infinite and it's like a smaller video. But it is what it is. Sometimes we need to showcase the not busted items to, you know, to get a better feeling about how busted the runs i'm doing normally are you know uh and yeah i think that's it pretty much i'm flexing a bit too much here but uh, it is what it is man sometimes you have to be a bit happy about the stuff you achieve in life anyway <laughs> what did you achieve in life today i broke backpack hero <laughs> anyway that's going to be it for today once again thanks for watching thanks for staying here for at the very end for my random comments and jokes and uh, yeah that's it once again thanks for watching and see you guys around